What's up guys and welcome back to Tyken Sons Lumber Co. As you guys know, it's been a few days since we hopped on this game, but that is because the FNAF VR DLC obviously came out and you guys already know I had to hop on that and cover that. But since I stopped playing this game, I have had nothing but comments requesting me to get back on the game. Like literally every FNAF VR video was like, hey, uh, when's Tyken Sons coming back? Hey, Tyken Sons later today? Tyken Sons anytime today? Well, here you guys go. It's finally back on the channel. We're gonna be hopping back into the game. Let's go ahead and start the game and hop back in. Alright, so I really don't remember what we did last. I remember that new animatronic showed up that they tossed off of like a mountain or something like that. And we met a seagull that I'm pretty sure is evil. And yeah, that's where I think we left off. So good morning. What a beautiful day it is yet again. Sea Bill is our first customer. He wants you to build two things, a broken ship and a wooden bird. He will surely give you something in return. So don't keep him waiting. It might be money. Now go off into the world and uh, oh, what, what the, okay, there's a, a frog. A floating? How is that even holding him up? Good morning. Are you Tyke Chop? That's me. You're under arrest for sleep disturbance and theft. Wait, what? Officer Frog? What? Why me? Your killer machines have been seen last night wandering around the city and breaking into houses. They were taking some precious jewelry with them. This can't be. I gave all the plans to my son right here. Maybe he sabotaged them. Wait, what? Uh, what? Since you're, since, since he is a minor, you still will be held responsible. Since when are we talking about age? We're animals, gosh. Oh, he just threw me under the bus? You can't talk yourself out. Your chip-chopping robots are a danger to the inhabitants and will no longer be permitted. What if I prove you that it wasn't me? I can do that. Give me a bit of time. Please don't make this difficult. Get in the police car now. <laughs> Where is there a police car? What's a car? Move now or I'll take out the taser. Mike, do something. I'm not doing nothing. You just tried to get me arrested. What on earth? <laughs> Don't drag your son into this. <laughs> what is he saying? What is that? You really built those machines and you didn't see any problems in the plans? <laughs> Fine. You got until tomorrow to prove your innocence. If you can't do it, this company is going to get shut down and every robot is getting destroyed. Remember, tomorrow, that's one day, not a day longer. So somebody sabotaged our machine. I mean, we did build them, but it's his design. <laughs> And that, son, is how you avoid the cops. But something isn't right. I really don't recall doing something illegal this time. We need to get to the bottom of this. You need to get to the bottom of this, because I'm old. But since I really need some money now, go grant Seabill's wishes. I can't believe you just threw us under the bus, dude. What kind of dad is that? <laughs> okay, so what's our task here? Um, build a shipwreck and a wooden bird for his stylishness, Seabill. Okay, so plans. Let's see. What do we need? What did it say? Hold on, let's see. I think I'll remember when I see it. Spider cave? No. Palm tree? Lighthouse? No. Chip of Matt 2. Wow. Imagine if we would have built one of those. They would have definitely hated me. Okay, so he wanted a wooden bird and a shipwreck. Now, here's the thing about this game, and I've seen this complaint a lot. It's a very grindy game, and yeah, it's just like, it takes a lot of time to get all this stuff. Like, wood isn't that bad. Lumber's not that bad. Feathers? Eh, I don't know if this needs I don't know if I have a thing set up for that yet. Rope? Ship parts? Like, that? It's literally gonna take years like you have to go through and like <laughs> you have to go through and just constantly get those little bugs and water bottles and anchors like this is gonna take a very very long time but let's go ahead and check out the area again just in case they got these guys all chopping down stuff but they move at the speed of molasses like we got to get rid of these little dudes right here I'm pretty sure let me go ahead and how do I get this thing to go oh we got new uh, lumber coming in see like lumber and wood yeah super easy to get but everything else is like yeah it's a very I don't know why I, like I mean obviously play through the game is there something I'm missing or did he purposefully make it like super grindy I don't see the purpose of that they're like why would you purposefully make your game like this all right come on wh why is he dude he's so I can't even get to him because the tree is in the way <laughs> okay come on here we go come on oh my gosh there we go I got an old saw Yay, an old saw. Just what I always wanted. I bet you could build, like, I mean, obviously building these other things would obviously make this a lot faster, but it is a very, very grind-heavy game, which you guys have all told me in the comments, and I completely agree with. Um, I guess we'll chop down these trees, though, just to get them out of the way. Get them gone here. There we go. Plant some more there. Uh, let's go and make our way towards town again, though, just in case. I want to see if they're, like, what, if we can purchase any of these items. Oh, let me get, go ahead and get, little, get, get rid of this little guy. I can't speak sometimes. Or most of the time, actually. All right, there we go. What do we got from this? A good rock. Nice. <laughs> a rock. That's just what I wanted. All right, let's go this way. The magic cave, which we need to get in here, too. But we need 200 tokens. Like, that's insane. That's literally insane. Dude, these trees are huge over here. I'm going to get all this wood real quick. You know what I'm talking about? Like, the wooden stuff is super easy. Whoa, he was, like, glitching out right there. You saw him? He was floating. 
right, let's go ahead and cut these down. I remember last time this glitched out the game, so I'm a little bit worried about doing this, but... All right, I need to get rid of these little guys. Can you stop moving? Holy, dude. <laughs> there couldn't have been an easier way of getting rid of these guys. Like, come on. <laughs> now the tree's in the way. Are you kidding me? There we go. Good rock. Yay. Oh, the trees are in the way again. Who would have guessed? All right, get out of the way. I wish I could just, like, stomp them. Why is that not a thing? Why can't I just, like, eight town stomp them or something? We got seaweed. Wow. <laughs> seaweed. All right, let's go this way. Okay, so now we're in town. We got some more lumber. Got some red lumber, good rocks, palm branches, coconuts, water bottle. Okay, one thing that we actually needed. The rest of that, we really didn't. Let's see. What do we need again? So we needed, like... Okay, we need... We have enough wood. We have enough lumber, because I can turn that wood into lumber. I think we'll have enough feathers. I, I don't even know. Um, water balls. I just got my first one of those. That's going to take years, like I said. Rope and anchor. I, I, I don't know. Guys, to be honest, like... This game, it's very grindy, and it's so much easier because you can just go into the percent app data, and you can just change the things to where you have, like, if I want 20 of these, I can just set it to where I'll have 10 water bottles, 10, 5 ropes, and 20 ship parts. Like, I don't, like, let me know in the comments right now, guys. Do you guys mind if I do that? Because me, personally, I, I, I don't see how it would be a big deal because literally it's just, like, if not, it would just be, like, 30 minutes of me just grinding and doing the same thing over and over and over and over again. Or I could just go into the file, change it, and then we go back to the fun parts. But, I don't know. Maybe that's just my opinion. I mean, let me know yours in the comment section down below. Do you guys mind if I go into the percent app data? Yes or no? Let me know with a comment down below. I imagine most of you guys wouldn't mind, though. But just let me know if you are, you know, one of the few that, you know, do end up minding um, about it. Because, I don't know. I mean, if it is possible like i just i know it's gonna take years to do i imagine most of you guys would just be like yeah go ahead just skip it <laughs> it's too grindy to skip it but i mean maybe i'm missing something like i said i could just be missing something where like there's an easy way of getting all this but i don't think there is at all like i watched a few playthroughs um of nothing new but like old stuff and everyone the, if you notice it like other playthroughs they don't ever show themselves collecting everything because they all just do the same thing they just go to percent app data and change it in the thing and i'm like okay well i need to do that <laughs> I need to do that exact thing because this I'd be here for years. How do I don't okay, yeah, I already talked to this guy. Like we could obviously build more crab shacks and stuff like that, but it would just to get the supplies to build all these crab shacks like this and all that other stuff, it would literally take hours and hours. So I don't know. I think what I'm gonna go ahead and do though is I'm just gonna go into the percent app data and just change it. So let me know, like I said in the comment section right now, if you guys don't mind or if you mind or not. Um, but anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and do that right away. Okay, guys, so we now have all of the stuff. So as you guys can see, 25 out of 20 lumber. 101 wood, 8 feathers, and then for the shipwreck, 5 ropes, uh, 20 ship parts, anchor, and water bottles. So, we can now build them, but we gotta find a place to actually put them down here. So, I'm gonna collect all this real quick. See, like, the water bottles would actually be pretty easy. Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, I think if you built what you needed, it would be, like, super easy. I, it would still take, you know, you'd still have to, like, sit here for who knows how long, just waiting for stuff to come in. But it wouldn't be as grindy. Um, so, we wanna build a shipwreck. So, I would just do that and then build. Yep, there we go. So we got a shipwreck there, and let's go this way and build something else over here. Um, where can I, where's a good, all right, right here, right here should be a good, okay, I can't cut that down. Oh, that's the palm tree that they wanted, that's why. All right, so let's go ahead and craft again, but this time we want to go ahead and put a wooden bird. So this is what he wanted, now let's see what he wants next. See, Bill wants to thank you for your efforts, go meet him at the birdhouse. All right, cool. Like, this is the part that I like. I like the storyline for the game and, like, that night system. That's what gets me excited. Whoa, does Sea Bill actually live here? Yes, child, he does. It's his cabin. And we're talking about the one and only Sea Bill? The one who survived the most brutal robot attack today? Oh, how convenient that he survived it. We do, kid. Stylish hat, exotic residence, owner of Sea Bill Industries, trademarked. That's him. Whoa, that's sick. I'm his biggest fan. Especially the story about him surviving the robot attack is incredible. Yeah, see, they brought it up again. They make it very obvious this guy's evil. Oh, watch I say all this, he's not even evil. True, but he doesn't want to talk about that, really. You gotta respect that, understand? Understood. All right, well, watch out, people. I'm going in. How do I get in? There we go. <laughs> Thanks. The wooden bird and broken ship will come in handy someday, I assume. For now, I don't really have any tasks for you, and I think it's only fair that I give you something in return. No, not money. Who told you- What the- uh, <laughs> Who told you that I'd actually pay you with money? I have something far better. What? Some peeps were talking, talking about me outside? They mentioned a robot attack? I feel a bit uncomfortable talking about that, but I guess you deserve to know. It happened a few years ago. I was attacked at night by a giant- Thingy robot. A loud noise woke me up. I looked out the window and saw the machine. What the heck? Okay, that's not the kind of robot I, I was expecting. If it had we it had weapons all over it and it looked like a giant floating egg. I tried I tried reaching out with my wing, hoping that it'd come in peace, doing it like an adult, you know? 
The only thing that I've gotten in return was a light blue beam that destroyed my house. I ended up lying in between piles of burned down wood that once were my cabin. But surprisingly, I was unharmed. Eh, convenient story. To this day, people think that I'm invincible, but that's rubbish. I was simply lucky. It was a sad thing, though, as I've lost a whole lot of money that was stored in the cabin. Oh, yeah, you seem to be doing just fine, buddy. You got an elevator over here on the left side that leads to who knows where. And then you got, like, all this other stuff. You got, like, an ocean view. But bad things happen from time to time, and I'm just happy that I'm still alive. Anyway, back to the main topic now. What I actually want to give you is this. A key card to the elevator. See, I knew this. That leads to the, to the most epic place you'll ever visit. Go take a look. You'll like what's down there. See, this dude's got an elevator. Like, he's hiding something down here. I'm about to go find out. Dude, he's gonna, he's gonna trap me down here or something. <laughs> what the? How does he just have an el- he, he said he lost a bunch of money in that, that little cabin that burned down. But this man still has enough money to build an elevator system under his ocean view cabin. Okay. What on earth? <laughs> Okay, this is not what I was expecting like a dark creepy cabin with like animatronics in here I'm not here for the music. It's too loud. I just think the DJ is really cute Okay, this is so calm and relaxing. What? What did you say? Sorry, the music is really loud That's why I'm screaming like this. All right, get me out of here, bro I, This is not what I was expecting. I was expecting some dark room with like, okay, I found it <laughs> I found it staff only Okay, see, look, see this little, like, layer down here, dude? He's hiding something. I knew it. Okay, what did he want me to do down here? What was I supposed to do down here? <laughs> Why did he send me down there? I literally don't... I want this whole spiel about how there's, like, an evil robot down here, and it was gonna be dark and creepy, and then there's a freaking rave going on. I mean, at least that, like, side room, there's definitely something suspicious there. I mean, come on. He's got some kind of weird hatch that says employees only. Something's going on down there. Okay, what did you want me to do? Go take a look at what I just did. I just did that. Okay, I. <laughs> I was just down here. I just took a look at what was down here. It was a party, a rave. What do you want me to do? Want me to participate in it? You want me to start like head bobbing and dancing? Want me to be the DJ? Like what the heck? All right. It, I guess he wants me to go to the right, maybe again, and check out this room. Let's see. This is the only like mysterious looking area, but I can't. Can't do anything in here. It's not like I can just water it and it'll open. I guess it wants me to do something over here. Who did I not talk to in here? Let's see. I talked to you. I talked to you too. Yeah, I talked to both of you. Maybe I can keep going? No. Okay. Um. <laughs> Wait, what if I water it? No, I thought maybe like short circuit it or something. Oh, okay, what if I just sit in here maybe? What do I have in my bag? Anything important? No. He just said he wants me to hang out. Oh, I'm dancing. What the? You actually start dancing if you just stand here? Oh, there it goes. Hey, is that beaver dancing? Rad. Aren't you the son of Tyke Chop? Son of the great Chipper Chop? I heard that your family had some sick remixes to offer back in the days. You should ask your father if he can lend us a classic beaver remix. All right, can I leave now? Okay, so that's it. Anything else? I think that was all I had to do down here. Do you have anything new? No, okay. Let's go in here one more time just to be on the safe side, and then we'll get out. Okay, yeah, so now I think I'm good to go. I just had to dance for some reason. Here we go. Back up to the top. I like how it's just, it's just us in here. It'd be funny if, like, one of the times you go up, it's just you and, like, the DJ, and he just says something weird. Oh, man. All right, well, we'll be up there eventually. <laughs> what the heck is this, dude? It's so random. All right, so hopefully that was what we needed to do. Oh, yeah, he's gone now. Okay, so let's collect our mail real quick, collect all this stuff. Um, wow, nice. Now, now we're getting feathers. Okay, so... Where are you right now? What do you mean? I'm at, I'm at his house. Does he want me to go back to... Where are you right now? Why is it... Okay. I guess it wants me to go back to my house? It's just asking me where I am. I... I oh. Oh, okay. I thought something was going to happen. Where'd this guy come from? Oh, yeah. He's been there. He wanted me to sell that... He wanted to sell me that creepy mask. Reminds me of, like, a Majora's mask. <laughs> like, some kind of mask from that game. I don't know. It's always, like, so creepy looking. All right, let's go this way. So we got to make our way back to our house. I'm assuming we're done for the day, even though we didn't get paid. So I don't think our dad is going to be very happy about that. But, you know, sometimes you just don't make any money. <laughs> and we made no money today. So we're going to have to go back pretty sad. Dad is not going to be happy. I right, move out of the way. All these little gooey things, I don't want anything to do with them. Dude, if that cop sees that guy, he's going to definitely do something. Oh, here we go. We're back. Hey, oh, good that you're here. Listen, I need your help again. I need you help again. One of my older robots that I thought was destroyed reactivated himself and now runs amok in the dump. Are you evil? 
It's either you or the Berg. What if they're both like working together? No, he wouldn't do that to his own dad. Uh, you still owe me one since the coffee incident yesterday. Go fight the robot. What? <laughs> go fight the robot? Like, you're not gonna help with that? Or make it go away? I don't care as long as our precious company is safe again. Good luck, son. Oh boy. We're gonna go fight a robot. That's fun. All right, so I'm, did he say this way? Oh boy, what on earth is that? Ew. Something happened that really upsets me. I was supposed to get trashed, yeah, yet I'm working perfectly fine. I still woke up here in this dump this morning. You animals wanted to trash me. You disgusting, smelly animals. Look at my six pack. I'm ripped. Ripped. I'm going to crush you. I'm going to smash you to the ground, sit on you, tear you apart, and make lumber out of you. Wow. You think you could stop me even if your stupid father is too scared to face me? That's why he sent you? He knows that I'm strong. He made me and forgot to permanently turn me off. Sad thing. Time to suffer, beaver boy. So, what on earth? Okay, what? Uh, what do I do? What do I do? Why is he throwing axes like that? I don't... Oh my gosh, dude. What is happening? Can you calm down? Okay, are you... Can I hit you now? I think I have to water you? Okay, I can water you. I can water you. Okay, what do I gotta get you to? 100? There you go. You're at 100 now. What? Why is he... What's going on? Oh, oh, oh I gotta press something on him. Okay. Uh, run away now? Okay, he's back to doing that again. That's great. So I've gotta just water him. And then chop him up. I have to literally eat him. That is insane. Oh my gosh, dude. Eat those three of them, dude. He is intense. Water him quick. Holy moly. Okay, there we go. Eat him. Eat him. There we go. Just eat a six pack. That is disgusting. All right, now what? Why does he actually have a six pack? <laughs> He's chopping wood, isn't he? Like, what does he do over here? He's not doing any curls or anything. I don't know. Or not curls. Uh, what do you call his sit ups? Oh god. Okay, I'm just going to keep. Not uh, getting hit by these axes. Come on. Here we go. Just stay over here. Okay, he's back on the ground. Whoa, he's to what the? Okay, I didn't know that was going to happen. What? Why are you back up there now? I didn't even get to water you. Okay, then. This fight is weird. He's still throwing these. You're not even near me. Are you blind? Where are you throwing these? Okay, look, I'm not even moving. I'm literally not moving. <laughs> I'm literally not moving and he's been okay. That one would have hit me. Okay. Are you gonna randomly throw more at me or do you want to give me a warning or something? Here we go Okay, chop him up. Please tell me he's done. Oh my. Oh, he's done. Yeah Woo, he blew up. That's what I'm talking about, baby Give me that congratulatory music. It's congratulatory a word. I doubt it. Okay. I knew you could do it Overall a pretty neat battle. I give it a 7 out of 10 so the DJ and C Bills Underground Disco wanted a beavery song with a sick beaver beat. Glad to see that I can deliver. Glad to say that I can deliver. I was young once too. I know what's hip. This one is called Look What You Made Me Chop by Timber Sw Oh no. What's an old classic? Who can dislike that? Okay, I hope this isn't going to be copyrighted. We'll see. I hope the few scratches on the disc haven't done anything to, to the tune. But there's no matter. There's no better way to know than to try it out. Go, son, and tell me if they liked it. I've got to go deliver this, dude. I'm just trying to get to the survive the night system. <laughs> now I'm like a DJ. I'm like a, I got to go build stuff for a, a freaking seagull. And now I got to go play uh, like a DJ. Oh boy. I wish there was like a teleport button. Like you can just like press it and just go there. That'd be nice. But all right, let's go ahead and just go this way. Obviously we got to run all the way back now and deliver this music to them. And then they're going to listen to it. Then we got to dance to it. And then I'm assuming we'll finally be able to start the night. Which is what I'm trying to get to here. Because this main story is so weird, dude. It really is. Alright. Back through here again. Alright, so I think it's... Oh, yeah. It's down the elevator. I want to see what this is. I think it's a mini game, right? But we haven't tried it yet. It would be interesting to see what it does. Because there's that one at the end of the dock, too. But... Alright. Back down the elevator we go. Back to hanging out with me and my, uh... My water bucket thing. I got a monster here with me, too, by the way, guys. So, uh... That's what I've been drinking right now. So, if I seem like I have energy, that's why. But... I don't know. Do you guys drink monster? Because I remember when I was, like... 12 13 i used to love drinking monster and playing black ops one if you guys oh, i'm sure you guys have played that but black ops one zombies on five or on like any of those maps with monster staying up all night oh those were the days thank you let's try this out all right here we go <laughs> it's gonna be awful oh oh what the Dang, he made this? Oh! Oh! <laughs> what? Wow! What on earth? Dude, good thing we're underground or this whole building would be like blowing up. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. We fell through the floor. You know what that means. 
Yep. The secrets. What the heck, dude? We're underground. Hey, you! Are you slacking off? I hope not. Back to work. Wait, your helmet. Where's your helmet? You must wear your helmet at all times. Here, catch. What? <laughs> We just <laughs> okay, whatever. These robots don't build themselves. Go gather materials from the caves. Collect 200 robo rocks and put them in the container over here. Yeah, right. You're 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 joking, right? I'm not doing that. No way. Um, our barrels are really weak. Even a mouse could break them. See, I knew there was something going on here, dude. This guy's got a whole robot factory. Need key card. No key card detected. Oh boy, what the heck is this little robot he's got? Wait, I can talk to you. Look at my little dancing boy. Look at him. All right, so let's go up here, I guess. It's a bunch of these guys. This is the fifth helmet helmet I lost this week. The inspector is going to get so angry when he hears about this. What the heck, dude? What are all these? Can I break these or something? No. Let's go back down. So he wanted me to get, like, rocks or something, but I don't really see a way of getting rocks. I'm assuming I can break these barrels, maybe? What does it want me to do? Because, look, I, oh, I can't even use my watering thing. All right, so maybe I just, it just wants me to go over here then. No. Uh, collect 200 Robo Rocks. Put them in the container over there. Where do I get Robo Rocks? What on earth? So I need a key card for that. I need Robo Rocks. This guy has a little dancing friend. There's these barrels that I can't do anything with. It must be up here somewhere. I must have missed it, maybe? I can't do anything here. Huh. What if I just jump off? Oh, no, you can't. <laughs> All right, well, I'm kind of just trapped down here for now. Because I, 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 you would think I'd have to break these little barrels and get stuff. But maybe if I click on them? Oh, that... Okay, then. That would be nice to know that that's a feature. <laughs> so I got a helmet. I guess I can give it to this guy. Maybe he'll give me some Robo Rocks or whatever. My helmet! Thank you. Here, I have a secondary key card for the mine bot. Take it before the inspector sees that you've lost yours. Thank you. All right, well, I guess we might as well grab these coins. Uh, I don't know what the only thing we really need coins for is to convert them. I oh, know we, we can use them on certain things, but let's just go down. Key card accepted. Happy mining. Oh boy, we're going down. Collect Robo Rocks with the mine bot. Oh, okay. So this is like uh, this is like that Friday the 13th game that we played. All right. So I hope there's a reset button. I oh, know we can just go this way. Oh boy, dude, this is gonna be what? I can't go that way. Why can I not go this way? Looks like this one could break, but okay. What does it want me to do then? Oh, you can hit it and it'll break. So does it, I guess it doesn't want me to go that way. Um, this is gonna be hard. Oh boy, I was not expecting a game like this. This reminds me of um. Oh no. Wow, it sends you all the way back. What the heck? Okay, so I've got to go through this all over again. How did I even do this, dude? I literally. Oh yeah, up here, then down, down, uh, up. How the heck down <laughs> up this way and then here we go got it all right let's try not to get attacked again because yeah i don't want to go through that again how do i okay wait so if i is it possible to go through that other one no it's not so i'd have to go through here i just have to wait okay there we go oh boy dude i don't know how to feel about this already okay so we got this i need to go oh boy um how the heck? Oh, boy. This is already annoying. <laughs> Why is this in the game, dude? What is this? This is so random. Okay. Um, up through here again. Okay. So we got to this point last time, but it wants me to go like... How do I get past this point? Because it wants me to go down. But you, I, I just hate that you have to time this so perfectly. Okay. So if I go left, like if I go this way and then up... I can cut right and then go down. That's not going to do anything. I can go left and then down. That's not going to do anything because that'll just send me back to where I was. So I'd have to go this way. Oh, okay. I go this way and then up. Oh, man, dude. This is so annoying. All right. So here we go. Made that. And then through here and down. Okay. So now we're here. Okay. Can I break this one? No. So oh, I can break I can break both of these. So I might as well break that. Grab these. So I could have broke that other one in the other room, but whatever. I'm sure I'll be back there pretty soon whenever I lose. What the heck? Oh. Oh, am I going around? Yeah, I am. Wait, what? Uh, what? Okay, now I'm here. Um. <laughs> this is so weird, dude. This is so, like, not at all what I was expecting. Because <laughs> we're playing as a 
beaver. How did we become a robotic bug? I don't know. All right, uh, let's break these. Oh, we got to make sure that we don't break that one. Not yet, anyways, because I got to go... Wait. When do we want to break it, though? Oh, I don't know. This is interesting. All right, so... Wait, no, I've got to get these first, no matter what. So to break this first... I hope I don't have to collect, like, all of them. Okay, so now we got these, and I can break this to have a shortcut. Okay, so I need to break... I need to go up and then around, and then break this one again. This should break it, right? There we go. Then down, through here, and then up. All right, now we got to watch out for these little guys here, even though I do have a shortcut now, which is good. Hey, I have to keep going up and down to break this. <laughs> all right, there we go. Let's break this. Okay, now I need to go down, but... This is such a pain, dude. Okay, that's annoying. <laughs> oh, boy. All right, let's try this again. Luckily, it's easy to get there now. Okay, through here again. All right, now we're back. Okay, so the plan is... I gotta get down there again. How did I do this? Oh, yeah, this way. And then I, I do this every time I lose. Oh, great. This is fun, right, guys? This is so much fun. All right, so... Why is this a thing? I've gotta go down, but, like, at the perfect... Holy crap, dude. This is so annoying. Okay. Oh, my. Whatever. I got it. Whatever. Oh, uh, this is weird. Very, very weird. Okay. So, here. How the heck? Did... <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay. Up here. Then through here. And then down. No. <laughs> oh, my gosh. All right. So, we're going to go... It's up through here, then down, then through here. Okay, there we go. All right, we're back here again. Now I've got to go up and around this again. <laughs> Why not just restart us at that at this room? Why put us in that other room if, if there's just a shortcut to get to here again? All right, here we go. Okay, so I need to break these. This one I should be able to break from right here. And then how do I want to do this? Because I need to get those two down there too. All right, so let's go ahead and grab all these. Break that. No! <laughs> okay, well, that's a problem. I've got to break this one. And then down. Oh, great. So this is going to send me into here, though. How do I get... How would I even get those two? I don't, I don't know if you even have to get all of them, though. Oh, what is this? <laughs> I'm going this way, dude. Okay, so break... Okay, I didn't know I was just going to shoot right through there. This is... Uh... All right, I gotta do it again. I, I really hope they don't expect us to get all of these. All right, down, back through here again for the 50th time. Okay, so we gotta cut across again. Okay, so I've gotta just go down now. Go through here, grab all these, cut through this. And then I gotta cut through the other one. But then how am I gonna, oh, and then I can get those two from down here. Okay. So there we go, grab all these, and then we gotta break this. And then up, down. No, I did not mean to do that. Uh, okay. Well, this is a pain. Oh my gosh. All right, so we gotta break. Oh wait, I can just go this way, actually. There we go. Okay, so I gotta go. Why is this, why? Okay, great. <laughs> this is, <laughs> guys, aren't you having fun right now? This is so much fun. <laughs> I'm having a blast. Wait, I, I think I have to get like 200 of these. I hope not. If, if, oh my, if we have to actually go through 200 of these, holy, I'm just going to start it whenever we beat it, if that's the case, but we'll see. Or I guess whenever I beat it. All right, so I got to go down or I can just, no, I can't go that way. I can go up and then down. I think I should do that. I feel like that'll be easier. Up and then down. Yeah, and then I can cross here and then just go up whenever he hits it. There we go. All right, now this part. This is annoying. All right, here we go. Come on. I don't know when to even go. When do I go? <laughs> it's just, it's like, oh my gosh. This is the worst part of the game. All right, guys, I'm going to start it whenever I beat this. because I, I doubt you guys want to see this. I think I am just about done. Yeah, I did it. All right, I am not collecting all of them. No way. That was one of the most frustrating parts of the entire game. That was so random. All right, congrats, you got 209 of that thing. Perfect. I think I only need like 200, so I'll take it. All right, now what? Let's see. I'm assuming I'm going to get caught by him, right? I mean, he has to know I'm down here. Keycard accept. No, 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 game. 
Oh, game, game, game creator, game creator. If you're watching this, why put a a robot right that is gonna send you into a very long mission? <laughs> Right there! <laughs> no, there has to be a way out of this. I'm gonna try um, pressing escape, maybe. Please don't go. Okay, yeah, that's good. All right, there we go. Um, I knew, I figured that'd be how you get out of that. Cause I was gonna say, like, there's no way he's gonna put a game that you just automatically get into, like, if you just press space that you can't get out of. All right, so I've got to go deliver this. Uh, let's see, Robo Rocks. There you go. Break time. Break time. Break what? Time. Break time. On Break Earth? Time. Dude, there's Break so time. many of them. Break time. Break time. Break time. Break time. Wow. Okay, I guess I'm gonna have break time with them. Oh, animatronics. And yeah, that's a uh, circus. That's a little bitty bab thingies from the Circus Baby's Nightmare. Uh, this is where our Baby's Nightmare Circus. And this is where workers come to rest and enjoy some of our entertain entertainment animatronics. Oh my good. So cool. Shh, just, oh, just because I was allowed to bring you to work today doesn't mean that you we can go all crazy in here. Let's just watch the brand, the band. Where's the singer? Oh yeah, the lead singer. Um, uh, do you really want to know that story? Tell me, please. So you probably knew about the, the special robot Sibo produced himself a few years back. Yes, I do. Summer crab and the mushroom one. Oh, and the beaver. Yes. So he made one for us workers too. Who who did he make? Oh, he was a duplicate of Sibo, only a little larger. What the heck? What if he got taken over by this guy? Like, we all think it's Sea Bill, but it's really the robot. The name was Sea Billy, but most just call them Sea Bill.exe. It's like a. He was designed to entertain and serve drinks and ice cream. Hmm. That's not what he did, did he, though? But as you can imagine, this didn't end well. Uh oh. Oh, he beat him up. What the heck? We heard about Summer Crab and the other special robots going wild. Hmm. One of our workers got so scared that he tried to destroy Sea Billy. Why would you just try to destroy him randomly? What on earth? We were able to stop him, but Sea Billy was broken. <coughs> I'm, I'm slowly dying over here. Hmm. The other day he was he was missing. He was missing. The other day he went missing. We assumed a malfunction made him leave. Whoa, scary. That's so cool. I hope he visits us someday. Then I can meet him. Better not. No one knows what the damage really did to him. Well, oh, imagine if he'd come to get us at night while we were sleeping in our house, not knowing. <laughs> Whoa, dude, imagine if that's what's happening to me right now and the game's telling me. Whoa. Wouldn't that be an awesome horror story? I don't think that's a new idea, bro. Aw. Okay, so... Oh, dude, we can put an animatronic here. Which one can I build? Let me see. I can put a chip -o mat like, can I build my own animatronic? Is there a new thing here? Let's see. Fancy light. Oh, Rockstar Fredbear. I got an endo torso. Yeah, I saw that. I got that. I don't know if I was recording. I got that in that um, that bug mini game. Okay, so we can obviously build him. That's gonna be cool. Rockstar Fredbear, ready for a performance. Cool. All right. Well, that's cool. So obviously we we gotta make sure we come back down here and build him later on. Um, let's see. Oh, I'm going back up. So, I guess it's not really like an evil factory because that kid brought his kid down there. Or that guy brought his kid down there. So, yeah, I guess it's... I don't know. I mean, it's still weird building stuff down there. Um, but let's go ahead and go back up. I wonder if he'll know that I even went down there. I don't... I don't oh, snooping around doesn't understand... Doesn't understand the concept concept of privacy. Mike, I wouldn't... I would strangle you if I could. I can't do it in the open. I shut off this dang music. Anyway, I have to think of something fast. I have to take him out where nobody will ever find his body. I remember there being a good place for it and someone to do it for me. I have to make him go there by himself, though. Nobody could ever know what my deal is. And if that doesn't work, well, I'll probably have to reactivate it. Ah, <laughs> I'm so evil. <laughs> mm, he's so evil. I knew it. He's evil. Where have you been? I was in a dance club for about 30 minutes playing a bug minigame. I was slightly worried. Worried because you don't have a brother who could take care of all the mess that a missing mic would cause. And we actually got two more submissions. You'll be doing these for the rest of the day. Is that clear? Are you what? Someone wants to build a rock chop. They are practically the Chipomat 2.5, but not really. See that you get this done soon. What? <laughs>
There's more to this day? I just, uh, I've been recording for like an hour. This video is literally gonna be like an hour long. Holy, I was supposed to do two videos today, but currently it's like six o'clock when I'm recording this. So this video probably won't be up until like 8.30 if I'm lucky. Oh, okay. All I'm saying, if you guys made this far of the video, smash like because this is gonna be a long video. All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and just do the thing in the percent app data thing because if not, we're gonna be here for years doing this. Um, let's go ahead and find an open spot. Okay, so right here. What did it say you want? So I want you to build rock chop now. You might need rocks for that. I might actually have the stuff to build them. A rock chop. Hold on, let's see. Frog shed, uh, rock chop. Rock chop, where are you? Can I put a Fredbear out here, actually? Rockstar Fredbear. Yeah, I can put one out here, I'm pretty sure. Okay, he looks creepy. Oh, I only need, oh, mini rocks and good rocks. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and set this up and I'll be right back. All right, guys, so we now have everything. Let's go ahead and build it. Like, that's what I'm saying, though. Could you imagine, like, okay, keep in mind, this video was recorded, it's been about almost an hour of recording, and that was with skipping all of the grinding sections, including this part right here. With the grinding, I would have probably been recording for three to four hours. That's insane how much grinding this game has. That's really crazy. So I can see why there's been, you know, a few complaints about it. But okay, so let's see. Another customer wanted a store machine. Look, this would have taken even longer. <laughs> you may want to build something else first. A storm machine. Holy, okay, let's see what this is. Oh no, oh no, it's doing this again. All right, I gotta restart the game, guys. I'll be right back. Okay, so all I did was go back to the menu and then it, it seemed to, yeah, it fixed itself. Okay, so a storm machine. Let's go ahead and find that. Was that the same tree that caused that glitch last time? I wonder. All right, so let's do this one, please. Okay, there it goes, it worked. All right, so we wanna build. No, not, okay, I'm gonna do this tree. All right, did it. All right, so storm machine, where's that at? What is that? That looks like the guy's, yeah, it's his drawing, or his avatar. Storm machine, clouds, magic heart, glass cage, metal bar. What on earth? All right, well, I guess I'll do this stuff and I'll be right back. All right, guys, so now we have everything. We're gonna go and build a storm machine, which is lightning and a bottle. All right, we got that done. Let's see, superb super beaver, whatever. It's late, you should surely wanna rest now. Oh, now I wanna rest. Yeah, totally, dude. <laughs> It's not like it's been, you know, like five days in real time over here that I've been out here. All right, let's go in. Time to rest. Finally. What a weird day. Do you want to go to bed? Yes, please. <laughs> Good night. Thank you. Holy, finally time to go to bed, bro. It's only been a few months. Later that night. All right, here we go. This is going to be hard. This is going to be so hard. Uh, when you hear the monster's voice, right-click to turn off the living room lights. You have enough time. Do your other chores first. What? You have enough time? Have enough time for what? To... I, I don't know. Okay. Do your other chores first. When you hear the monster's voice, turn off the lights. So it said right-click to turn off the lights. Okay. So I've got to listen for a monster's voice. All right. I'm going to turn on both earphones. So I'm not going to check behind me, though, because I don't, I don't think anything will show up back there. Oh, no. Why did I go up here? Will anything show up? I mean, you'd imagine something has to show up up there, right? Something. All right, this tip is gone now, so I think the night has officially started. All right, let's get to the door real quick. Nobody out there. Quickly go back. So this is going to be the plan. We literally just listen for a voice. If we hear a voice, turn off this light by right-clicking. Sit in the darkness. And if we see anything in front of us, obviously shine your light at it. Left or right, shine your light. Why do I hear, like, birds chirping? It's nighttime, dude. Oh. Something's out there. How long do I have to leave it closed for? I don't get the sleep assurance anymore, so I don't know how long I should keep it closed for anymore. Okay, nobody out there. Let's go left. Nobody out there. Is that the voice? Whoa, yep. What the heck is that thing? Oh. Yeah, no thank you. No thank you. Okay, lights back on. Okay, well, yeah, no thank you to that thing. That looks like a giant bird. <laughs> That's, oh, there's two of them out there. What the? Will I get sleep assurance for these guys? There's two of them. Come on, two for one deal. Nope, guess not. All right, well, that thing's creepy. So if you hear, like, laughing, I guess that's what I heard. Then you just turn off the lights. Oh, you're here. Hello, go away. Go away, go away. There we go. Okay. So this is pretty simple then. We just got, I mean, I'm saying that, but I'm probably gonna lose. It's only night three, by the way. There's still a lot more to go. Can I please get some sleep assurance from one of you? Okay, no. I don't. It's hard to get sleep assurance as the nights go on, that's for sure. I'm gonna have to get, grab batteries too pretty soon. Nobody out there. 
Let's just keep going this way. So why is there two of them showing up at each window now, though? That's pretty weird. All right, come on, come on, come on. Oh, knocking. I think that means that they're coming to the window? I don't know. I don't remember. Yeah, there you are at the window. I got sleep assurance. Wait, is he gone that fast, though? Yeah, I guess so. What the heck? He, like, ran away. Oh, you're here. Come on, give me some sleep assurance. Come on, baby. Come on. No? No sleep assurance. Is that you? What? Oh! What the heck was that? Okay, thanks, game. What did you want me to do? He was there. Holy. Okay, I need to go get batteries, so I'm probably gonna lose. Dude, what? I can't... Are you... I can't grab the batteries? There it goes. Why did it not let me grab them before? I don't know. Okay, I gotta get to you now. Yeah, you're here. Go away! Go away! Okay, come on. Let's go to the right, I guess? Dude, why did I get... What was that? It was like some kind of... I don't know. Metal animatronic. I mean, they're all metal, obviously. But this thing was, like, weird. I don't know. Okay, are you here? Yeah, you're here. Come on, give me some sleep assurance, please! There we go! Thank you! That's all I wanted. <laughs> Dude, he didn't, like, uh, like I didn't end the night whenever he attacked me. It just, it was very loud and sudden. I was not expecting that. I don't know who that was, though, because it didn't look like a beaver, like one of these guys outside the windows. It looked like something else. Uh-oh, turn off the light. Okay, so you're back again. Please don't randomly jump scare me again, game. Please. <laughs> okay, you're gone now. So I'm going to check here. You're here. I need to also get rid of... The frog, who I'm sure is there, whatever that is. Let's go check. Yep, I knew you'd be here. Okay. Go to the left. I knew you'd be here. Oh, we got sleep assurance fully maxed out. All right, I'm going to leave this closed. Go. Get back to the bed. Back to the bed. Back to the bed. Okay, how do I go to bed? Press B to go to bed. There we go. Holy, dude, that was an intense night. That was a very intense, very scary night. That guy at the door is creepy. So who's... Okay, so that's night three. So now we're going into night four. So there's still like two more nights. The early bird catches the worm. Dude, this is a very long game. Holy good morning. Ready to start your day with a bit of history? The answer is yes. Okay, guys, I got to end this video here. I mean, I don't know how long this video is going to be for you guys, but for me, it's, you know, an hour. So <laughs> I got to edit out some things. So I'm sure it'll be under an hour. But still, this is a very long video. If you made it all the way to the end of the video, let me know with a comment down below just saying banana. All right? Just so I see how many of you guys actually made it to the end. If you did... That's pretty incredible, because that's like you just watched, like, half of a movie. Like, you could have put in John Wick 3 and seen, like, half of it, or, like, Endgame and seen, like, the first hour of it. That's insane. So, if you watched this entire video, props to you guys, and thanks for all the support. But, yeah, I'm in this video here. In the next video, we're hopping into Night 4, and then, obviously, after that, Night 5, and then I think we're done with the game, I'm assuming. I'm just curious who's going to show up next. We got the door. We've got the windows. So, the next thing would probably be the bed. Because I, I think something's going to show up on there, for sure. I, it's an open bed. You can shine your light on it before you leave. So, I think whatever's going to show up next is going to be on the bed. And then, for the fifth night, I don't know what that could be. Because I don't know where else something could attack from. But I guess we'll find out. Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the video, leave a like. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button and the little bell icon to be first videos. And I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out.